Alright, so we are solving the tapioca debate. By making tapioca pudding yes. in Cameron's kitchen. By making tapioca pudding. Which is nothing like vanilla pudding. Yes, it is nothing like va vanilla pudding, which is the debate that that uh, tapioca pudding is just vanilla pudding with those with weird... chunks in it. Yeah, with those which weird chunks in it. Which everyone in the world knows isn't true. Yeah, it's not true. Except for stupid people. Exactly. This is tapioca pudding because it has tapioca flavor. Exactly. Exactly. So, we've just added a half a cup of tapioca pudding mix, and, what is it, two cups of milk? Yes. Yeah, two cups of milk, and we're supposed to heat it to it boils, so... It's gonna take a while. Yeah, it's gonna take a while. So, um, okay. Alright, as hopefully our viewers can see, this is the ingredients to tapioca pudding. And if you look closely, or you don't actually have to look closely, there's absolutely no vanilla in the ingredients, which probably means that we are right in our assumptions that it's not the same thing. And we're still mixing it, and nothing's really happening. But we have got the club crackers out and chocolate, which I just had some, and we're ready for the long haul to wait to be proven correctly. Yeah. <laughs> it's still not boiling. This tapioca thing is taking longer than I thought it would. Seriously, taking forever. Alright, it's like 6.05 right now, and didn't we like start this at like 5.50? <laughs> it's only about like 50 minutes, Cameron. Okay, but it's still taking forever. I mean, usually stuff that I make, like, you know, ramen noodles boils fast. In three minutes or less. Three minutes. Yeah, I know. It takes like a, a max of six minutes to make, because it takes three minutes to boil it, and then you have to leave it in for three, no, four minutes to boil it, and then three minutes to turn it in, so it's actually seven minutes. You know, ramen noodles are freaking amazing, And as amazing soon too. as you pour in the flavoring, it's ready, which is amazing. I know, unlike this tapioca pudding. I hope this is as good as... We put the flavoring in in the beginning, and it's still not ready. Really? Yeah. Okay. The flavoring being tapioca flavor. <laughs> We're still making tapioca pudding, even though I, to be honest, Cameron just turned off the thing like two seconds ago. Yeah. Um, now there's really absolutely nothing to do. Except watch Happy Up the Pudding. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Want to try something fun? Yes. Put it on high. Okay. What's happening? Wait, leave it on. <laughs> no, no, no. Do you see that? No. There, there are tapioca beads in it. <laughs> Would you put it with the mixer? Sir. Do, do you not see the tapioca beads? Yes, I see them. Haven't see? they been there the entire time? Well, no. They just started forming. Well, it hasn't boiled yet, though. It smells like tapioca to me. No, I think so we didn't put it on high enough. Well, you're not supposed to put it on it's high because it it'll burn it up. You can't boil thick things. Well, fine. Let's turn it on higher. Okay, it's boiling. Yeah, it's boiling. Kind of slightly. It's not boiling. Yes, it's, it's, see the bubble? I can't bubble, zoom in. Oh. Bubble, bubble, bubble. Okay. Shoot, wait, it's going out of focus. So it's boiling now. Yeah, yeah, it's boiling now. Okay, so, so, is it supposed to get to like a full boil? Probably. Okay. I have no idea. And we, more interestingly, actually, we just put in a corn bag in the microwave. Not which, like a popcorn bag, like this like therapeutic thing. Yes. And it makes it it's kind of like those like hot pad things that makes you feel good when you put it on your back. But it's or better because it's corn in a floured bag. Yeah. Like this. Yeah, this video is getting so sidetracked. And Cameron actually couldn't find an apron, which is terrible. I guess I shouldn't film nothing at all. <laughs> um. What you just raiding the? Yes. The pantry. Okay. Did well, you guys? Did, oh no, you didn't. Okay. I I don't know when we're supposed to stop. <laughs> Great. Just keep stirring, I guess. Ah, oh, it's boiling. It's boiling. It's boiling. You didn't let me say my exciting line. Um, well, you kind of said it as I was pressing the record button. <laughs> so, this is probably the most exciting thing since the fact that we just put the corn in the microwave. Is it still going? Did you put it in for three minutes? Yes. Okay, so it's got and like And we are about to prove to the world... That tapioca is not vanilla pudding. It's not the same thing. It tastes different. Tapioca uh -huh. has its own flavor. That tapioca has its own flavor. Uh -huh. This is... It keeps fogging up my glasses. 
Um, yeah. I'm surprised it's not fogging up the lens, but that's oh. not the point, is it? But can you tell on the- wait, can you tell? Hold on, let me see. Can you tell that my glasses are- Kinda, not really. Um, I think now? it's- I think it's thick enough. What about now? I don't know. Uh, okay. <laughs> sure, whatever. Uh, I think we should pull that now, maybe. Okay, um, hold on, what does it say? It's at a full boil, so maybe we should take it out. Pick start! Ah, I'm starting! Um, 15 minutes stirring twice. Stop it! I'm stirring it. Is it boiling for 15 ah, minutes? It's done! Um, I. Quick! I don't know what it says! The corn bag's done! done. Full boil! Putting thickens as it cools, remove from heat. So we're supposed to remove it from heat. Get the corn bag! Okay, the burner is off, but I wouldn't touch it. And keep stirring because it cooks after it stirs. It's oh, still no. boiling. Ah! 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 This is amazing. Though. I know. It smells like corn. I know. I actually really like it. I know. It's like, like I put it on my back before I go to bed sometimes, like when I'm sick, and it makes me like get to sleep faster. Like when I have like a sore throat, and you like, you know how you can't sleep then? Yeah, it helps. You can stick it on like the back of your neck, and it feels amazing. Oh, I can imagine. This feels great. <sighs> oh yeah, that that's the corn bag on Katie's <laughs> stomach. <laughs> but it's really amazing, like... See, doesn't that make your lower back feel so much better? Oh my gosh, yes. That's actually for real, like, amazing. Yeah. Um, so I think we're just supposed to let this cool. So, we'll get back to you after it's done cooling or something. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> nice job. I just ran into your gun. So the tapioca has cooled after boiling, and we're now going to put it into this little container so that we can, um... Can we grab my corn bag? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I got the corn bag. Okay, so we're going to put it into, um... We're going to put it into this container, and then we're going to put it into the refrigerator, and then it's going to cool. <laughs> and then it's going to be... Obviously. It's going to be amazing. And, and not taste like... No. Not taste like vanilla pudding. Yes, exactly. To tapioca. The flavor. So I think it's time to try this stuff now. Alright, let's do it. This doesn't taste like vanilla at all. No, it tastes like tapioca. It's not just the texture too. It's the flavor. flavor. Yeah. This means we won. I think it did. Maybe we should get someone else to confirm that this is indeed tapioca. Hey, hey Kristen, come here. Kristen, come yeah. on. Try this. Wait, what does it taste like? Yeah, taste it. I want you to tell us what does it taste like. Does it taste like tapioca or vanilla? Tapioca, of course. I Thank think you. we've proven our point. Cheers. So, um, here are some careful points to consider about tapioca. Tapioca is its own flavor, not vanilla. Tapioca is a light yellow color. Not green, contrary to popular belief. Or just Katie's belief. Contrary to popular belief. Um, um tapioca has a um, weird texture with bead-like things in it, but this isn't the only difference it has with vanilla pudding. Again, tapioca is a flavor. Tapioca actually comes from the rhubarb root, I think. Really? I know. Ben's Ben's so. Ben's Which means it must be true. Did you find it on the internet? No. Um, tapioca is a vicious debate, and despite this indisputable proof we have before us right now, there will be people who will be so blind in this, in this pursuit for the truth when it comes to tapioca pudding. <laughs> in no sense. So what? Pretty much the world is filled with ignorant people, and we're here to try and inform you of the truth. Yep. <sighs> All right. Well, um, I don't know. What are you going to do now? Reheat the, uh, corn pad? I don't know. Sounds like a plan to me. <laughs>